Our WPF chart control ships with a bunch of built-in animations specific to each series type. It allows you to modify existing animations or create your own if needed. I already have a project that contains three stacked bar charts. To enable the animation, select the chart control in XAML and locate the animation mode property. You can specify one of three modes. Disabled to disable animation, on data changed to perform animation every time a chart's underlying data is changed, and the on load mode, where the animation is performed once as the chart loads. For this video, I'll set the animation to on load. Next, select the first bar stack series 2D in XAML to access its animation properties in the properties window. Select the Animation Auto Start Mode property, and you'll see this property has three modes. Play once, the animation is played once, after which the series receives its final state. Set Start State, the series receives its start state as it appears after the animation is finished. And the Set Final State mode, series receives its final state as it appears after the animation has finished. I'll leave the default Play Once mode as is. From the Point Animation property, you can select any of the animations to change. I'll choose Bar 2D Bounce Animation for the first series. I also change the Animation Duration property. The Chart Control also provides the Point Order property. You can change the default point order for the series point animation, selecting Straight, Inverted, or Random. In this video, I'll leave the property set to Straight mode. I also set the other two series to different animation types. Bar 2D side from left animation. Change the animation duration time as well. and Bar 2D Side From Right animation. And let's take a quick look at the resulting XAML code and then run the app to test our animations. And that's it. Thanks for watching and thank you for choosing DevExpress.